Rabakande, Zakabaradi Arapa, Elebradia Korabakande, Gone are the days, gone are the days where youth just come and gather for the clubs, Korabakande, Oh Pazu Vradia Rabarade, Embradia Korabakande, Zakabaradia Korabaku Vradia Rapa, Melecon de Legiala Zuvradia, take this time, take this time and tarry, take this time and position yourself, position yourself, position yourself, position yourself, Barabaradia Rapa, Oh, try to go beyond the canality, go beyond the canality, go beyond the fresh, go beyond the fresh, Ila Bazu Vradia. Heavenly Father, we know you're baptizing people, Lord. You're baptizing people in your wisdom, in that which you have. We know it's not a mistake to be here. We know it's not an accident, Heavenly Father. Oh, Rabba Kusa Labrade. This is your agenda. This is your agenda. This is your appointment, Lord. This is your appointment, Jesus. Liparakufade. Zakabaradia Riparakufade. It's really a shaming. Uh, it's really a shaming to come here and you go without meeting him. Yet he's the one who appointed you. He's the one who appointed you. He's the one who appointed you. Laparadia Kufade. Oh, Salabaradia Kara. Rabakande, Melekom Bradia Pazu Vade, Lipaku Vradia Karabarade, Malem Bradia Kurabahande, La Zubradia Karabaku Vade, Zakabaradia Karabakande, Melekom Bradia Pazu Vade, Child of God, don't settle for less, don't settle for less, don't settle for less, don't settle for less, Marabarade, there is more, there is more, there is more beyond what you know, there is more, there is more, there is more, there is more beyond how you have been praying, there is more beyond the style you know, there is more beyond how your church does things. There is more, there is more, there is more. Go for more, go for more. Go for more, go for more. Go for more, child of God. Go for more, child of God. Go for more, go for more. We are not settling for less tonight. We are not settling for less tonight. We are not, we are not, we are not. Oh, shalabaradiyarapa. Zekom bradia pazu fradia karabakuza la baradia rapa em bradia korabahande melekom bradia parazu fradia korabakam bradia laba zaka baradia karabarade li paradia ko fradia melekom bradia lapa zora bagi la suta la brade zaka baradia korabaradia lapa may you come and lead us Lord may you come and lead us tonight Heavenly Father come and take us wherever you want us to go Heavenly Father we are just open Lord we are just expecting we are just expecting whatever you have for last Jesus, but this time, Lord, we open up our hearts, Lord. We open up our hearts, Lord. Oh, Rabba, come the labor day. We are parting for that you have for last, Lord. We are parting for that what you have for last, Lord. We just, oh, we just raise our appetites, Lord. We are raising our appetites, Jesus. We are raising our appetites, Lord. We are raising our appetites, Lord. May you come and fill us. Oh, give us the spirit of understanding. Reveal more to us, Lord. Reveal more to us, Lord. Beyond what they have written, beyond that which you have written, child of God, the Bible says, That which I has never seen, and that which he has never had, he has kept it for you. He has kept it for you. I don't know, maybe what your eye has never seen, but the Bible says that he has kept it for you. What your ear has never had, the Bible says he has kept it for you. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Shalabaradi alaba. Give it up for the Holy Spirit. 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 Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We are going to have fun. Harukunisia to Vesha. I have realized it's a big life from hell. You can see it, you can see it. Hallelujah. Those who don't know me, Abatanzi, Amazina and Janit, Kwayuhich Lenga Albert. Hallelujah. And the player part. Hey. 
one of one of the parties I love. Hey, hallelujah. It's the party Christ recommended. Hallelujah. Mezeneza. Gira mujenzo yangu mezeneza. Are you ready? Are you ready? Gawanyi dini mubgire, gawanyi dini. Today no rubjiruko please. Gawanyi dini mubgire, mezeneza. Gawanyi dini, gawanyi dini. Ibi nubjava nusanga wata nyaganyaka. Ibi monstro nyaganyaka kabisa. Ibi monstro nyaganyaka. Jena abjimvish. Ibi monstro. Turanyaganye Papa wa chini na guru kete mwa chini. Tula mwa chini na kujenga nuko mama chini. Wakose mukose vima na mama na gumu jisha. Wakose kusinduka. Misha lugovge niza. Abja iwa chini na wari harani ba guru kete mwa chini. Hey, muko mama chini misha. Mama na gumu jisha. Mama wakose kusinduka. Tay Allen. Muhanzi, we have got here to the summer. I mean, I have got come out here. Hallelujah. We must. They have to know we have gathered. They have to know we have gathered. No, could it seems I don't know you, but there is something that is going to happen. Muranya made a little. Shwa la kubwa ajewe nda unwa player party, ese player party, na bwa nyabano, patarengi chumi kuri fraya, ese inyuma ya bumbu na ya bandi, bitu kwa nguo the promise, rafuga se bini bichi, lero nyeme rafati yumanya, mubgi le player party, awari bo, mubgi le nyuma unwa bari ho. Na na the promise, abarivu. So prayer party, altar youth fellowship. Run very much in the child youth. Ako na babja itula bachira. Kaja kusanga kuburu bjiroko. No bordu jenda. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. No bordu jenda. So ya kubaso mela abarivu. Prayer Party Altar Youth Fellowship is a dynamic Christian youth ministry aimed at equipping young people with the tools, knowledge, and faith to navigate the challenges of today's world. I have come to define the word fun. Uh, you see? So, while making a positive and lasting impact in their communities, rooted in the teachings of Jesus Christ, I need to give you mono, need to give you Minister Cedric, need to give you Muhammad, need to give you Buddha. We speak Jesus. We speak Jesus. All the teachings, all the teachings to Vuga as prayer party, it's all about Jesus. Every fun we have, it's all about Jesus. It's in Christ. That's why the Bible says, in him we live, in him we move. And in him we have our own being. So, yes. Our vision. Our vision is to cultivate and empower a youth generation that is exemplarily living for Christ. We don't speak about Christ only, we live Christ. Hallelujah. Knowing him and making him known. To fellow youth. That's why we organize conferences like these ones. We, we are not selfish. We know this man has changed our lives. So ours we live to make also others know him. I'm trying to explain the vision. If you're not in a prayer party, it's a place where you should be. I don't know which lock you're under, but prayer party is where you should be. Empowered by the Holy Spirit. Whatever we do, we are empowered by the Holy Spirit. The Bible says it's not by power. Not by mighty, 
not by skills, not by certificates, not by degrees. That's my vision. That's my version, by the way. It's not what the Bible says. The Bible does not say certificates. That's my version. Yeah. Committed transforming the world around through love, compassion, and ministry. So these days, the way we fellowship, we gather online. These days, if you want to fellowship with us, we gather online on Google Meet every Tuesday and Saturday, 8.30 p.m. running time. Hey, we welcome those people who are online. We welcome you. Thank you for being with us also. The reason why I said run on time, there are some people who are watching us globally. So, community. Currently, our major platform is our online WhatsApp community. The people who are there, they are beyond 1,000. So, you can see the Lord is vindicating the calling. The Lord is behind the calling and vindicating that. So, we meet every month. Every three months, we meet and fellowship together in conferences as this one. So, I think that's what I can say about player party. But if there is more, it's just more than a youth ministry. It's a movement of young people on fire for God, committed to living out his purposes in the world. That's what we live for. Through prayer party, altar youth fellowship, we believe that a Christian, a Christian youth can be, can be catalysts for transformation. That means those who bring transformation wherever they are. Bringing hope, bringing healing, bringing reconciliation to a broken world. As we ignite, as we ignite hearts, transform lives, and change the whole world together for the glory of God. So that is player party. You can give love for them. Yes. Thank God for the good vision. Thank God for the good vision, please. You can do better than that. Yes, thank you. So that's that's the vision of Player party altar. Now let me, who is the promise? One of the things, the reason why we are doing this, we are not marketing. But the reason why we are doing this is because testimony matters. You know, even the Bible says two cannot walk together unless they agree. So the reason why we are doing this is that whoever that is going to be ministering, whoever that is going to be here doing each and everything, you have to know them. Oh, this is the promise. Oh, oh, the calling is this one. This is prayer party. We understand. We have the same spirit. That's why we are doing this. We are not doing this to, 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 to market. You heard that it's for the glory of God, whatever we do. It's not about us being popular. Uh -huh. The promise worship Rwanda. The promise worship Rwanda is a vibrant Christian worship group ministry dedicated to exalting God Almighty. It's not just God, God Almighty. Through music, impacting all generations, with the message of hope, faith, and love. If you came without hope, you're going to receive hope as they worship. If you came without faith, you're going to, your faith is going to be fueled, and you'll encounter love as they worship, because that's their mission. Our mission is also to create an atmosphere of authentic worship where individuals encounter the presence of God and are transformed by his love. The Promise Worship Rwanda offers a variety of programs and activities designed to engage and inspire and empower individuals in their journey of faith, including worship. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, my guys. Hallelujah. Anyways, the promise of Hari to Jacquin Jeramania Kuramiman. 
niba kubwi impamvu z'umutekano na transformation ikiri mu kazi telefone yawaza kuyibika kugira ngo utaza itaza ko gutera ikibazo cyo nitangaza naba ntanze kugira ngo uramye ya you know hey. someone may miss someone may bless themselves maybe they come praying for that lero no ku uze kuyibika neza kugira ngo turamye nta kintu ki kiguteye ikibazo haleluya haleluya wasanga yajaje kwakira Kristo gatoma telefone ye ata ata ha ata mwakiriye rero telefone yawe yibike neza kugira ngo turamye imana kabisa tumeze neza so let's be welcome the promise the promise the promise give it up for them 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 until they reach here we are going to worship 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 the promise the promise the promise we will welcome you we will welcome you in the altar the promise the promise the promise we will welcome you on the altar one of the things i love about the promise you know there are those people who worship god and you you just understand that they are worshiping my god and there are those people who worship god and you wonder i think this person is not worshiping my god but the good thing about the promise when they worship they are not just worshiping you see that these people they are really worshiping my god so please as they are going to be here ministering it's your time it's your time with the lord please don't one of the things i always tell people when we are in this presence the person who is in, who is sitting next to you the person who is standing next to you doesn't matter doesn't matter you see the person who is sitting near you the person who is standing near you they don't matter i know they are your friends but the bible says john 15:15 15, you know that the bible says i have called you friend that means there is another friend which you are going to be worshiping and who is jesus and the bible also says that there is a friend who sticks closer than your brother i remember recently i was asking myself who is who can be there so in this time i'm speaking this so that when we start worshiping let the music be just like some a platform for you to worship your god let music be just a platform for you to worship god go beyond the music as you worship him go beyond go beyond the because there is no music that can explain him there is no music that can explain you know, who he is to you so i encourage you encourage you that as we are going to be worshiping please take this time it's it's an intimate time i have never seen i have never seen like uh, a wife and a husband who who do their who do their intimacy outside you know like when everyone is seeing them when so this is a place of intimacy with the lord it's a place of intimacy with the lord we are going to be worshiping please i allow you to lose yourself i know randans you understand this this someone is yours randans you understand this please today let's try to let's try to be christians and sons and daughters of god in the presence of jesus because sometimes please don't don't mind what you're wearing if it's high heels it's okay you can even put them aside if you see them blocking you to worship god as you ought to you can put them aside but let nothing be like block you to worship god i beseech you by the masses of god i really beseech you by the masses of god when we enter this moment of worshiping him open your heart just open your heart and tell him here i am take me take me take me beyond the music take me beyond the good voices take me beyond the lyrics i want an encounter i want an encounter you know 
I don't know maybe if you understand what we call encounter. When they speak of encounter, it's beyond, it's beyond a visit. Encounter, it's when you meet the Lord. Hallelujah. I believe today we are on the Mount of Transfiguration, where the Bible says, the Bible says that when Jesus prayed, he was turned into a lightning. So like, do you know that presence where someone prays and even the, the, the clothes they are wearing, they change. They change. You know, one of the things I love, God is old school. Tell your neighbor, God is old school. Tell them, the youth understands my language. Tell them, God is old school. So, you know, in music, there is what we call old school and new school. You get that? So, God is not like a, a rap music. Where we have old school and new school. God is always the same. That's what the Bible says. The reason why I'm saying this, if God could answer people and they pray and their clothes change, that means he has not changed. Unless if you believe in a new school God. But the God we believe in, which is the God of the Bible, there is no new school or it's, the, it's old school. So our God is old school. Give it up for the promise as they come on the... On the altar, on the altar. Give it up for them, give it up for them, give it up for them. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, clap, clap, please. Yes, yes, yes. They took their time, they went for rehearsal, they have been preparing, they checked the sound. Clap, clap. All of those that you have been going into your programs. Clap for them, clap for them, clap for them as they come. Clap for them. Yes, yes, yes. Clap for the Davids. Clap for them. With a smiling face. Some people, please. A smiling face. Yes. Prayer party. Others can stop, but prayer party, you can't stop that. You know us being here is because of the Lord. Prayer party, if you're here, you should, you should, you should do it more. Do it more, do it more, do it more. Maybe the visitors we allow you, you cannot clap. But if you belong to prayer party, if you belong to prayer party altar, you should understand this. You should understand this. We are not here because something just happened. We are here because it's the work of the Lord. Please clap, 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 clap. Yes, 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 yes. Clap, clap, clap as we all come them, as we all come them nicely. Heavenly Father, Heavenly Father, we thank you. We thank you, clap, clap, we thank you for this moment of worship, Lord. We're going to worship you because you deserve it, Lord. We're going to worship you because you deserve it, Jesus. Oh, without you, Jesus, without you coming, Lord, we shouldn't be worshiping, Lord. But tonight we worship because you came, and tonight we worship because you lost. Tonight we worship because you lost, Lord. If you never come out of that grave, Heavenly Father, we should not worship, but because we worship, we worship because we know that you came from the grave. We worship because we know because we remember the crown of thorns because we remember we remember the cross we remember we remember the journey we remember how naked he was we remember how naked he was and we worship you we worship you for the stripes we worship you for the stripes the bible says that by his stripes we were healed worship him for the stripes please clap clap until all of them comes until all of them until all of them comes you can start release your melody now start releasing your melody release the melody release your melody release your melody let the melody flow the bible says let the melody flow allow the melody flow allow the melody allow the melody Woo! you deserve our praise no you deserve our praise jesus you deserve our praise no you deserve our praise no you deserve our hallelujah you deserve our hallelujah you deserve our hallelujah oh we deserve our hallelujah heavenly father when we remember the incarnation jesus we give you glory 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 every time when we remember how you came and put on the face jesus we worship you we praise your name we praise your name we praise 
praise your name child of god worship the lord with your own words worship the lord in your own words worship the lord in your own words oh the one who saved you the one who saved you the one who saved you worship the lord in your own words child of god worship the lord in your own words don't wait for anyone worship the lord in your own words in your own words in your own words oh there is that song you can compose now compose a song for jesus compose a song 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 child of god don't stop don't stop don't stop yet 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 compose your own song 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 okay let's welcome the promise the promise the promise will welcome you Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Are you guys ready for this? Really? So we're going to praise God. So I hope everyone just brought her best moves. Eh? The moves, eh? you know. So we, we're, going, we're going to really praise God, worship, go deep into the word of God. So I receive the Holy Spirit in this house, right? Amen. So let's go, guys. So, we are studying this.
Nuko inumbi igwiri amagufka ya Elisa akokany uomono ara arazuka arabatuka arahagarara. Amen. We must travel and go. The kibdiap for kibdiap to visit. Agakany. Amen. Now go through the journey. Zajo. Now go through the journey. Zakobi. Kobi zuka ni mukorova. Agakany. Amen. Amen. Na kunzi bja pe muzima bgawe ari ku munsi birazuka. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Um I want to I want to to introduce my team. Uh you know mo ne ukuriye worship team yitwa Rugamba. We yitwa JD Tranga Kostik, Kanumri Rindi. Uyini Mdiwa Chowaren, the music director. Uyini Keve Kungoma. Hari, Hari, Mutranzoa Chow Electric, Cleats. Mpacha Tuwati here. Hari wako stick, David. Sorry chief, we're going to be done. Hari mtu anzo atua piano. Sensea. Hari mtu sorry mwenye mwenye mtu sumbat kwa yuse. Itwa. Itwa nia. Itwa Prince. Itwa Charles. Changa piano. Our co Gareza, we it got it out, it by Rina. Amen. Nikona Wanakanya Muname Mutugire, I could Twava Kuns. Amen. Is there a good Amen. Amen. Let's worship.
Ever since when has a possible ever started? Friday disappointment, the Sunday's empty door. But since when has a possible ever started? The sound of dry ones lottery. This is the place where the dead men walk again. Are you going to walk? Open the grave, I'm coming out. I'm gonna leave, gonna leave again. This is the sound of dry ones lottery. Hostified, sternly something new. You're not gonna lie no for miracles anytime soon. The resurrection power will rise among us too. I believe there's another miracle here in this world. This is the sign of the tribal. Make a dead man walk again. Open the grave, I'm coming out. I'm gonna live, gonna live again. This is the sign of dry bones that are near. Let, 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 
Nenskio sound yari kus yari kukura yowe. Nenskio sound yari kutumu kuma masi. Nenskio sound yari kutumu zamura maoko. Amen. Imana niyo kuwa ha. Niyo kwiri njirgo. Amen. Niyo imana shora. Kutuma amagufka yo yene. Akori jitangas. Like. Mono wapfu ya magufka ya kazu mono. Ibdo bdari misaza ano jia chere. No no hudu ftu muka wera. Amen. Duftem muka wera. Rabu zenga magufka na kahadije. Ari izira. Amen. Uwari muritwe. Ari hano nona. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Chachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachachach
kuri twebwe ese wari gukora iki kugira ngo Imana ikugirire imbabazi n'ikiye giciro wari gutanga kugira ngo Imana yemere gutanga umwana wayo umwe wenyine w'ikinege kugira ngo aza gupfire ariko duhagaza hanganga abanyarwanda nk'urubyiruko tuvuga ngo bati ko ku Rwanda rufite imana iyo mana twaye komera amashyi menshi iyo mana twaye kugiriza imuntu iyo mana twaye kugiriza imuntu Ikuzo Nibyo wamene amaraso Nibyo wamene Tukasurema ya magambo Amashimwe na majugu yacho Amashimwe Nibyo wamene Shimiri ya mana yawe Nibyo mana Winama Ikuzo Ndete no gohi Nibzo wa meni Tri manet kwezi Ama shimge Ama shimge Ni tu wa hiyo Haleluya Nibzo ngana Winama Ikuzo Samra majgu acho do shimiri mari hora ho. Amashimwe, nitsu 
seems to know could be colder. Yeah, 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 yeah. He turns in no call. He takes it. He's a tongue. See, my little kiss. Seems to call. Seems to call. Hallelujah. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Oh, I wanna call some love. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. It's on the local. Do you take a say? Peter to Ghana. Not to Kuna Nira. Not to Kuna Nira. Not to Kuna Nira. Not to Kuna Nira. It's on the
Hallelujah. <laughs> Rutes ego, but 
pride of Zion, prophets spoke, our Messiah, fresh and boy, but you are not worthy to open up the scroll. Let's take this time and prepare the way of the Lord. Let's take this time and prepare all the way beyond the sound, beyond the sound, beyond the good voices we have been listening to. Let's prepare, let's prepare, let's prepare the way of the Lord. Jacaba dia melecom de le bras ouvra dia coraba can de le bras o telebrade. Prepare the way of the Lord. Prepare the way of the Lord. Allow the varies to raise up. Allow the varies to raise up. Allow the varies to raise up. Allow them. Allow them. Allow them. And make mountains. Let mountains come low. Let mountains become low. Let mountains become low. Let mountains become low. Maybe there is a mountain you came with. This is a moment. This is a moment you have to speak to them. Speak to your mountain. Speak to your mountain, child of God. Speak to your mountain, child of God. Speak to your mountain. Speak to your mountain. Marabakuja la parade. Li paradia kofra dia melekom de lepradia la pa. Zoko rabakan de lepradia la pa. Zaka baradia la pa kofra dia la pa. Li paradia kombra zufra dia rabakom de lepade. Allow that lion in you. Marabakuja la parade. Allow it roll. Allow it roll. Marabakai de be. Zata la parakufra dia rapakande. Melekom radia kofra dia la 
Raba. Oh, Satala Baradia Raba. One of the agendas of this conference, Maharaba Kande, Liparadia Rabarade, is to define what we call fun. Maraba Zota Labrade, Ilebereko Vradia Rapa Cabrade, Zaka Baradia Rapa. Oh, come from that valley, come from that valley, come from that valley, come from that valley, Maraba Kosa Labradia Rapa. Side of God, come from there, come from there. Melecom Bradia Paraku Vade, Zaka Baradia Rapa. Climb that mountain, Maraba Koere Pradia Lapa. Allow, allow that mountain to fall, Maraba Edeba. Zotele Pradia Koraba Kande, Zeleberagia La Suvade. The Bible says he's able to do exceedingly, exceedingly, child of God, exceedingly abundant and beyond what you can pray for, Marade Paradia La Suta La Prade, Melebereko Fradia Ripara Kande, Zaka Baradia Paracote Le Prade, Zeleberagia La Sombra Dia Rapacande, Maraba Kai de Bay, Zaka Baradia Rapa. Oh, we are preparing the way of the Lord, we are preparing the way of the Lord. He's about to touch each other of God, Marade Pazuta La Pradia Lapa. We have come for an encounter. I want to remind you, we have come for an encounter. You have not come for the sweet ones, you have not come for the lecture, you have not come, Maraba Cote Le Prade. You have come to encounter him, you have come to encounter him, you have come to encounter him, Maka Baradia Pozo Radia Lapa. If you go home the way you come, that means Karaba Cote Le Prade. This conference has failed its role, Paradia Rapa. The agenda is to encounter him, the agenda is to become a catalyst. The agenda is to become a catalyst. Oh, Parabazo Telebrade, Melecom de Lebradia Rabacusa Labradia Laba. We want you to come out of here when you're the catalyst of fire. Li Paradia Covrade, Melecom Bradia Carabaconde. Allow the Lord to make you the sound of revival. Allow the Lord to make you the sound of revival in your workplace, in the school you go to, in your families. Carabacate, Li Paradia Covradia Lahande, Melecom Bradia Carabacata, Zaka Baradia Raparade, Embradia Covrade, Mele Zubradia Carabaki La Suta Labade, Shad of Go Parade, Jala Barade, Engage, 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 Marabaco, Bradia Rapa, Li Parazu, Bradia Candele Prade, Melecom Brazu, Bradia Rapa, La Paradia Rapa, Zota La Baradia Caraba, Go beyond your week, Carabacane, Go beyond that proper Maradia Rapa, Go beyond Zara Baradia Rapa, Zoco Bradia Carabacane, Go beyond your image, Maradia Rapa, Go beyond your family, Li Paradia La Covade. I want to remind you, child of God, you are the child of God, you are the daughter of God. Pazu Vradia Rabakande, Membradia Karabakande, and the Bible says, Jalabarade, that He has blessed you with every special blessing that pertains to life and goodness. Lipa Radia Rapa, that's yours, manifest your blessing. Lipa Kandele Pradia Kurabaka Brade, Jaka Barakatalaba, Lipa Radia Rabako Fradia Lapa, there is nothing you're asking. Oh, Paradia Rapa, that He has not provided for you. Jele Pradia Kurabakande, it's your time to position yourself and manifest that which is of you, that which is of you, that which is of you. Rabaka Rabaka and the Prade, Zaka Baradia Rapa. Oh, don't glory. The Bible said, You shall run and faint. No, we are not of them that draw back. We are not of them that draw back. Child of God, we are not of them that draw back. Allow the Holy Spirit Karabaka in the bay to energize him. Rabahande, Ila Supradia Korabaka Talaba, Arabagile Sombra de la Pa. Oh, the varies, the varies, Korababa, Zaka Baradia la Pam, Pradia Kuzu Fradida, Ilecom de Legiela Zufrade, Paraduza la Pradia Carabacande, Ah, Salabaradia Rapacu Fradia la Pa, Zelecom Pradia Curabacam, Pradia la Sufradia la Pa, Ilabacu Fradia la Pazuta la Prade, Yes, yes, child of God, yes, 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 make them, make them, make them, make them. Yes, yes, you can clap better than that. <laughs> Hallelujah. Ah, Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <laughs> <laughs> there is there is a revelation I got. <laughs> Never come in the presence of the Lord to find, but always come in the presence of the Lord to seek. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You are not finders. Hallelujah. We never came to find. So 
ngiye kubaho uyu mwanya sinzi niba momo abaye projector ewan fala telefone yawe protocol ya radufasha aba yafite munoki ari hano nutegereza indirimbo nutegereza indirimbo nutegereza indirimbo gose waza waza wazuka yatanga rona impamvu muzika ari nziza impamvu wafashijwe ibyuma na wafaranga haleluya leka dushyikire muri w'Imana kaza dushyikire muri w'Imana there is one man of god who said the gospel is heavy you cannot carry the gospel when you're broke hallelujah so please bring money yes don't wait for the song don't wait for the song yeah we now i'm going to go for please no money din if there is the way at your church they do it maybe today it's not the way they are doing it allow the holy spirit take you wherever he's taking you so bring money bring money mama code mama code my project in gabano bay protocol my first shaka the shirao code generation yacu ni abantu bagenda na mafaranga kuri telefone abenshi nago aba yafite ya birashoboka ya na kibazo ya mwakwisha ako muwe muri hafi kuko murakomeza muwe muri hafi muwe muri hafi kuko murakomeje mukomeza no kuri reka mugiye banwa amazi nago baduhereza indirimbo kandi Yes, mane gumo gisha mushi wanje na imani gumo gisha. Yes, 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 yes. Wili. Wili. Na what the project in je code. The project in je code comes. Ko shobora kuyivuga abantu niba cyangwa buri muntu afite telefone na kibazo nyivuge. Akanyenyeri jana mirongo nane na kabiri akanyenyeri umunani akanyenyeri rimwe akanyenyeri code sas mirongo ringi na gatatu mirongo ringi na gatatu abantu ko mutandika aha aha ego kaga kadi sinjye cyo muri mu w'Imana prayer party the promise ni mwebwe aba sponsor muhari don't wait for to welcome a sponsor gaze ngo ni tanzi jana nundi a let's do it out of the generous heart ko Imana yaguhaye ko Imana yaguhaye na bintu byo gukanda kanda don't wait for a, lo- a lot of sermon scriptures we know he has blessed us he has blessed us that's why we are giving he has blessed us that's why we bless one of the things i love about god when he blesses you he does not just bless you he makes you a blessing so as a blessing bless it's time to bless it's time for yourself this is an opportunity by the way it's an opportunity to express who you are because you are the blessing you are the blessing there is this scripture they can you forget maranye meranye fuge mu buryo the bible says he became poor that we may be rich hallelujah so reka reka tutagaye mafaranga rwo sitarabakire niba arabaye mukene ngo tubabakire eh reka tuyatange urangiza uvuge amen eh amajwi aracyari makeya reka dukomeze reka dukomeze 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 dutangira muri mabwi imana urangiza uvuga amen uwavuze amen nasubiremo wangije amen Eh baracyari bacye turategereje mukomeze code iracyariho no kuri no kuri like one of the things i've realized in the house of the lord is in the gahunda zose you be to a bold kuzivugaho akiye bigeze ku mafaranga it's a uh, <laughs> we shy out we don't have to shy out unless if you're here and the money you have you have stolen that money I allow you don't don't give a tithe first receive Christ you know yeah yeah ari ko rwose abandi bose turaha turabizi neza ko imana niyo yadashije mugisha akazi dufite company dufite rwose 
mukomeza gutanga aha abandi barangije bavuga men ah iracari imwe kanegereje na mushyo wanyi taratanga na na murumuna wanyi na mukuru wanje wundi rimo kubikora code iracari ho eh niriya niriya kabisa niriya utazu imibari banza kuri code ubanza kanyenyeri cyangwa 182 na kabiri akanyenyeri umunani akanyenyeri rimwe ito kirahiri ya code ugashyira amafaranga imani kuyoboye nabo nshaka ngutanga amafaranga uri butegeshe ah ah as god leads you as god leads you ari kari hafi nta kibazo you can have a walk with the holy spirit hallelujah 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 <laughs> there is one friend of mine he told me ajajira you know the way evening walks uh, he always has a walk with the holy spirit so Joshua rwose ari hafi today you can practice that and you pay na kibazo rwose nta mategeka bihana niko birivuka okay anyways turimo gutanga reka twiyegereze akozi b'Imana bari hagati muri twe turahera kuri mama wacu ugeze ahangaha benshi mu murebe na haguruka haleluya kadusaye mama aja kahaguruke mavu bivuze ngo mu murebe Eh eh Okwicarira eh ushaka kugera aho ugera yagufasha ni CEO wa Destiny Helpers yes urumva nta muntu dakeneye umuntu nyangunda kubwira abantu nkababwira nyuma sinzi impamvu abantu muri iminsi tutita ku bantu ari kibaze ni imana ishaka guce muri kibazo cyacu yahindutse umuntu ubwo rero niba hari ikintu usengera kandi mugenzi wawe agifite ukajya ku musozi kugishakayo nubwibone nubwibone rwose niba hari ikintu ubona afite ukajya ku musozi kugisengera kandi ubizi ko nakwigisha ukakigira cyangwa ngagufasha kugeraho nubwibone haleluya haleluya so ufite ufite ushaka kugera numuntu wa guhuma umuntu kufata kuboko muri kariere yawe haleluya eko ha abonye bakozi b'Imana bandi minister mut <laughs> let me leave that one yitwa nuyahera fred he can stand up yes he's the author he's the author of two books so far and more coming chapter Christ revealed akaba ni chini chitwa who do you say i am who do you say i am eh cyo ni kibazo ugomba kuba ufite nero yaragishubije sawa hari nundi umuri ku ruhande my brother you can stand up you can stand up and eh you can it's called shema joseph i call him the healing apostle eh <laughs> Hallelujah. There is another man of God. Why are you sitting there, sir? Come, come, sit in my chair there. Sit there. It's God Apostle Easy. Please give love for him. Yes. Hallelujah. Eh. Aja vuga ngo rubyiruko ni imbaraga z'iki? Eh, uru rubyiruko is the future of the church. I remember one of the things the Lord told me. Naji is in a vision and the Lord told me there is 2020 of Rwanda, there is 2050 of Rwanda, there is 2060 of Rwanda. And this was the question, where is 2020 of the church? Where is 2050 of the church? Where is 2060 of the church? So now we have hope. Hallelujah. Now we have hope. Arabacuranze arabaririmbye arabari ubwirize arabica yahangaha nta ufite nta waje nta waje ukabando nta waje ukabando eh nkababyeyi bari hano bakavugije haleluya mama Jackie gose waitera nta kibazo amen eh okay tujye mwanya mwiza the promise can come back you can come back nababwiye ngo ikosa ari ikosa icaha watahana icaha 
nukuva hangaha uko waje icyo ni cyaha leba hano leba hano ibiri iravuga ngo uzi gukora neza nabikore bimubera iki urabizi ko you need to encounter him and that's the right thing no gender ta ni cyaha i'm telling you i'm trying to i'm trying to to pull you the imam turi hano it's because we want you to take the full package of the conference you know every conference ascribes to something so one of the things one of the agendas one of the vision one of the the reason why we organized this no kugira ngo rgos uhinduke ni utaracira kristo wakire kristo ni waracire kristo ube refreshed hallelujah ube refreshed you know rgos noze kumva ko wakire kristo wumve ngo twajano kobera bataramwakira no no you can be refreshed hallelujah I am not saying you be born again again no to be born again once but you can have an encounter with Jesus hallelujah hallelujah that's that's my that's my prayer request that's the heart cry of the man of god tribuze kwachira organize bino bino it's a heart cry it's a heart cry i'm trying to speak his heart i'm trying to speak his heart we are not here to this is not a social place This is not a social club where people gather and just have fun and go. Today we have defined what we call fun. Fun is not holding the bottle. Fun is not having the cigar, the promise of Amos. Fun is not going in the night club. Fun I went in my dictionary with the small English I know. They defined fun is enjoyment. So some of us if you're in prayer party Thanks should be how you enjoy. Thanks should become your fun. Prayer should become how you party. Hallelujah. Go na the days where go na the days I told you from the beginning I'm and I'm repeating. Go na the days where we shall be bringing you to come and eat at church. That one is not there. Those days far from us. Where you come we have to motivate you there is a DJ that, and you come because of a DJ. Uh-uh. <laughs> you have to come because of Christ. Because of Christ. So join your hands together. Please. One of wait, 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 wait. In my culture, there is a way I honor people. And in Hebrews chapter 13 verse 16 says obey them that have that have the rule over you hallelujah obey them that have the rule over you we are here because of one man who organized this hallelujah so before i welcome him arise and shine 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 arise and Please we come we chain nibu narwaye uraza gucira mu gwaguruka please yes let's stand up 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 let's stand prayer party prayer party prayer party prayer party i can't hear you let's welcome minister excellent cedric yes 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 prayer party you can go ahead yes 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 okay shall we go Hallelujah. Oh. I thought I had people in this house. Oh, hallelujah. Hallelujah. Come on, hallelujah. You can lift those hands to Jesus. Oh. Father, we thank you. We lift your name on high Lord. All these people gathered here. 
We are not gathered in any other name except your holy name, Jesus. Father, this is because of your grace and mercy. We have saw you not once, not twice, not thrice, Lord. You have proved your faithfulness over and over. You have proved that you are a man after your word. You have proved Thank you, Lord. Our hearts, our hearts bow down before you. Receive all the glory, Lord. Receive all the glory, Lord. Because there is no one like you. And there can't be anyone like you. We lift our voices. Come on, open your mouth. Just before you ask, I want you to reflect. Reflect. Come on. I'm tired of people who always want more from God. More and more, more and more, more and more, more wins. But can't reflect and see what the Lord Jesus has did. Reflect. Don't be distracted. Don't look at me. I don't have anything to give you. Don't look at me. Close your eyes. You and Jesus. Don't care about anyone that you have came here with. It is you and Jesus. Reflect. See what he has done. See his grace. See his mercy. No, don't normalize. Don't take it for granted. <laughs> oh, Jesus. You can amaze people. You can amaze people. You can amaze people. Come on, are you seeing? Are you seeing? Personalize this year after year, month after month, day after day. Who do you think you are, my dear? Unless it is the Lord who watches over the city, the watchmen are in vain. Unless it is the Lord who builds, the builders are in vain. It's not about who you are. It's not about your parents. It's not about anyone. Is that voice and thank you. He's here to hear you. He's here to hear you. See, I want you to reflect. Encounter him from there. <laughs> Raise your voice. Ask the Lord Jesus, the Lord. Man and I need you more than I've ever needed you. In this wicked generation as this is, you need the Lord Jesus. More than, no, don't look at me. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Close your eyes and talk to the Lord. We are not here to scam you. We are here to talk of what we have saw, of what we have touched. Ha la 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 la. Ask the Lord, the Lord. As we gather tonight, may your presence touch my heart. May your presence touch my soul. 
May your presence touch my spirit. May your presence touch my body. Ay, 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 ay. Vrakata, Yamaro Prakata. I can't hear you, my brother. You are not ready. It seems you are. Oh. Raise your voice. Raise your voice. Bow down to the Lord. Chavugu fimbere ima. Chavugu fimbere ima. Mene terima na mumutima wao. Yipkine ngo mana. Nutamfata. Ndagwa. Nutamfata. Ndagwa. If you don't hold me, Jesus, I will fall. Talk to him, talk to him, talk to him. Yes, come on, come on, come on, come on. Take it higher, take it higher. Tell him, tell him, tell him, tell him, tell him, tell him. In your way, if you speak in tongues, go on and blast and pray in the spirit. And if you pray in the understanding, it is you and God. It is not us and God, it is you. Personalize it. Personalize it. Personalize it. Hi, 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 hi. Take it, take it, take it. Take it from your spirit. Take it from your spirit. Let nothing, let nothing distract you. Let nothing distract you. Oh my Jesus, we behold your glory. We behold your glory. Sharada do
turn to the book of Hebrews and chapter 11 and when you go to verse 6 the word of God says but without faith it is impossible to please him I love part B I love part B here part B for he who comes to God must believe that he is let's stop there let's stop there that he is who is jesus to you what is your personal perspective not as a group not as prayer party what is your personal perspective of the lord jesus tonight do you think he can change your life no do you think ashobora kukuvana kurwe can you see that if you don't see nothing is happening let me let me tell you if you don't behold that the bible is the, is talking to us that he who comes to god must know you must understand you must see your perspective should tell you that i'm not wasting time here i'm not passing time over i'm not here to i'm not here i'm not here because oh harindirimbo harindirimbo the promise je kudufasha i want you to perceive this jesus Chaka urebu you yes uri muri indirimbo I don't know there are no protocols here ibintu by'ubunyarwanda shira ku ruhande we are in the presence of God if you are to cry cry if you are to if you are to bow down if you are to roar on the ground if you no 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 no, no. <laughs> it is you and God my dear if you don't hold tightly you are falling and I'm not with you perceive this Jesus it is the one that we are talking about tonight my name is Shimne Cedric and that's all don't look at me Meet me somewhere else. I can give you my contacts after here. We can talk. Simzo, that is still done. Let's talk, Jesus. Come on.
that for you.
Aleluia. Aleluia. Let's give it up for the promise. Wonderful worshipers. Beautiful. Power packed. <laughs> Our generation is not ready for these people. I am telling you. So I'm super pleased. Amen. Hallelujah. Wow. Good to see you. It's been a while. Turn to your neighbor, give him a big say him you <laughs> tell to him that you are in for a great time. Tell him you are in for a great time. Wow. I'm always amazed by the works of God. It's always a blessing. It's always. And we are moving. This nation will not escape. The youth will not escape. We have to love God. Ubikunde, ubiyange, you have to love him. It is not an option for you. This is a sense of agency. This is urgently needed in your life. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We tell you the Lord, zeal of our minds and planning, Lord. But full, 100%, of your direction and guidance in the mighty precious name of Jesus Christ who have prayed amen yeah thank you so much guys for coming today to the Jesus encounter conversion conference to the gutangira and we are about to meet the Lord Jesus and he's about to change your life it's about to change your life. You know, there are some people who think that change is always from bad to good. But tonight, the kind of change, the kind of conversion we are meeting, it is from good to good. It is from glory to glory. It is from good to good. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. I have three questions that I'm going to be talking about. And then, yeah, we pray. We pray. The first question is, can Jesus change someone's life? And the second is that how can Jesus change your life? And the third question is, what really shows that Jesus has changed your life? Now, Turi wundi tuga singa tuga ta. I not question it Turi mo. Nanjen I'm here to be blessed. <laughs> I'm here to see what really shows that. Jesus has totally changed my life. Hallelujah. Make sure you are not distracted. That is key for today. Let's begin. Let's turn to the book of John. In the media, do we have scriptures, please? Let's turn to the book of John, chapter 5, and then verse 24. Please turn there. If you have a Bible in your phone or you came with it, turn there. We read the book of John. John. And then chapter 5. And on verse 24. Glory be to King Jesus. Hallelujah. 
Most assuredly I say to you, he who hears my word and believes in him who sent me has everlasting life and shall not come into judgment but has passed from death into life. Glory be to King Jesus. Can Jesus change someone's life? The answer today, it is yes. And I know our yeses are burning. Wait, we go. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. So Jesus can truly change your life. He truly can. We have examples. Let me not use the Bible. Let me use myself. Let me use you. Let me see. You can just wave if Jesus has truly changed your life. Uh -uh, like you mean it. Amen. This man we are talking about here. He lived for three years and a half. In this very same world you are living. Jesus is real. I'm not here to lie about it. It is the truth. Agree or not, he is real. And he has truly chosen you. And even tonight, he's still choosing you. He wants to change your life. He wants to truly transform your life. And hold on to it. Make sure you don't go. When your mindset, when your goals, when your desires are repositioned. Glory be to King Jesus. Hallelujah. Let's go to the book of John 15 and then verse 9. Who is this man that we are talking about? John 15 and then verse 9. As the Father loved me, I also have loved you. Abide in my love. In one definition of who Jesus is, he is love from what I've sung, from what my hands have truly touched. This man is love. Glory be to King Jesus. This man is love. Before we go to healings, to manifestation, to anything, I want you to truly have it in your heart that this man is love. And what shows that he is love, it is due to what he has done. Amen. Jesus can change your life. Settle it once and for all. Because the moment you are not looking on onto this man, you are looking onto your school, you are looking onto your career, you have already lost the game of this life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Don't lose it that way. Don't set off for two cheap things. To a point, Jesus echo to your school, to your career. Amen. I want us that we raise our perspective of how much this man has truly loved us and came down from heaven to earth, yet he was God. The Bible calls him the image of God. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. And the thing, the only thing that brought him, let's turn to this book. The same chapter 15 and then verse 16. You did not choose me, but I chose you and appointed that you should go and bear fruits. And that your fruit should remain, what, what, that whatever you ask the Father in my name, he may give you. Jesus chosen you. 
even before you chose him. That is why he came onto this earth for your transformation. Amen. So to it once and for all, there is still power in the name of Jesus that is able to transform lives, that is able to take you from bad to good, from good to good, and from good to good, and from good to good. Don't get filled up with what he has already done. Develop and cultivate a hunger into your life to even see him do more, to even see him transform your life gloriously even more and more, even more and more, even more and more. Hallelujah. Yes, Jesus can change your life. Let's jump into the next question. How can Jesus change your life? When I receive him, what happens? Let's turn to the book of First Corinthians, and the, sorry, Second Corinthians, chapter five, and then verse seventeen. Hallelujah. Are we there? Are we there? Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. That the old things have passed away. I love this second word. I hope, I, I, I hope we don't jump here. That behold, all things have become new. I love this word here, to behold, in other words, to see that all things have become new. When, we, when the Bible captures in Christ, we see it into the New Testament several times. Uri muri Christo yes, uri muri Christo yes, uri muri Christo yes. What does that word really mean? That if someone is in Christ, it is talking about the union relationship with God. Hallelujah. The union relationship with God. And what is union? Let me demonstrate for you. When my hands are like this, they are into union. And from what you see, from your perspective, they are one. But when I do like this, I have two hands. I, these hands of mine are two. But when they are combined together, however much they are still two, but due to the union, they have really become one. This one can't carry, which this one can't carry. Hallelujah. Please pay attention to, I'm taking you somewhere, right? Don't be distracted. Silence your phones. Bring your minds to here, right? How can Jesus truly change your life? The first thing I want to establish in your life today, I want you to know, settle it once and for all, that this union, that this new creation that the Bible is talking to us, it is your spirit, not your body. This is where most of us have truly missed it. Our perspectives, our expectations, when we went to that altar call, when we received the Lord Jesus Christ, we are like immediately the Cedric, my thoughts, my, yes, it is true. But the transformation takes place into your spirit and not into your body. What changes is your spirit man? First here. What changes is your spirit man? And all in all, what changes is your identity in him? Glory be to King Jesus. 
Let me talk a little bit about identity. When you don't know who you really are, you will never and never continuously and never manifest who you are. Not the soba nuchirwa, icho Christo yakoze mu mutima wawe, icho Christo yakoze mu mwuka wawe, you will truly have you will truly never manifest the outcomes of what he paid for. If you don't know and understand, let's start from there. Before we go into prophecy, before, before, the, before let's start from there. Do you really understand? Is, does your mind communicate with your spirit and brings understanding to what God has really done into your spirit? Let's turn to the book of First Thessalonians. Oh, my dear Christians, we ought to know, we ought to understand the precious blood of Jesus that he shed on the cross for me and you. Glory be to King Jesus. Let's turn to the book of First, Colin, of First Thessalonians 5 and then verse 23. Glory be to King Jesus. Sorry, it is Second Thessalonians. Oh, sorry, sorry. It is First Thessalonians, first five twenty-three. Let's jump there, please. Yeah, that now may the God of peace Himself sanctify you completely. And may your whole spirit, soul, and body be preserved, brameless. At the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ. The first key for you to understand your identity, write this down, write this, not this somewhere. The only way to understand who you are in Christ is when you separate yourself, when you see yourself from the perspective of what God created. That you are a spirit with a soul that stays into the body. Glory be to King Jesus. The key to understand your identity starts from right there. Starts from you understanding that this kind of Cedric that I'm seeing with this black skin is not the real Cedric. That the kind of Cedric that I see here physically is not the real Cedric. Hallelujah. So when you continue to see yourself as outwardly as you are, you won't understand your identity in Christ. You won't understand what Christ did for you. The spirit is the part of us that gives life to us. When you go to the book of James and then chapter 2, James went on and explains. Let's go there. James chapter 2. James chapter 2 and then verse 26. If anyone among you th thinks... Sorry, this James chapter 2, sorry. Uh, 23, 23 is talking that... Uh, Twenty-six. Sorry, I'm so sorry, guys. For as the body without the spirit is dead, so faith without works is dead also. The spirit is the part of you that gives life into you. Glory be to King Jesus. Hallelujah. It is the living spirit 
that gives life and surprise your and surprise life into your body hallelujah so before a person let's go to ephesians chapter 2 ephesians chapter 2 verse 1 I'm here to teach, remember. Ephesians chapter 2, and then from verse 1, And you he made alive, who were dead in trespasses and sins. Amen. Before a person makes his total commitment to the Lord Jesus Christ, he's totally dead. Glory be to King Jesus. And this kind of dead, death that the Bible is communicating here, it is spiritual death. When the Bible captures of this, it is separation. Glory be to King Jesus. When you go to the book of Genesis and then chapter 2 and then verse 17, where the Lord was talking to Adam, and say to him that when you eat unto this fruit, even to die, you will die. Yet Adam did, but he continued alive. Hallelujah. So separation from God is what the Bible talks as death. Hallelujah. Glory be to King Jesus. And... Uh, when you go to the book of Galatians, chapter 5. My God. How I wish my cry is that not this one thing, what the Lord has truly given into your spirit, what the Lord has made you to be into your spirit. Because when you know that, your life is changed. And because you are sons, God has sent forth the spirit of his sons into your hearts, crying out, Abba, Father. God has sent forth the spirit of his son. So when we are talking about that someone has received Christ, it is this kind of spirit of Christ that he has truly received into his heart. Glory be to King Jesus. So how does this ma manifest? How does this come into existence? And it is very much to always, always and always understand that what Jesus did, it was not for your mind. It was not for your body. We will reach there what was for your mind and what, was for, what is it that was for your body. For you to truly manifest. Glory be to King Jesus. So when we are talking about encountering the Lord. We are meaning of you coming into a full revelation. Of your identity. Of what is into your spirit. Glory be to King Jesus. Of the kind of the Zoe life. That the Lord has truly pressed into your spirit. Amen. And. Into your spirit man. There dwells. The completeness of peace. Joy. Love. Because it is not of your spirit, but it is of the spirit of the living God. And your spirit has truly been made perfect as the same as the Lord's Jesus. And I want to proclaim to you tonight that anything you may be battling with, that anything you may be struggling with, the key is here. Understand and know. The kind of person that you received into your life. Let me tell you, when someone receives Christ, the rest of his Christian life is teaching, is educating, is daily committing to this thing of 
understanding and acknowledging what has taken place into your spirit. When you receive Jesus, your spirit becomes completely changed. And he has the same exact spirit according to the book of Galatians chapter 4 and then verse 6. And because you are sons, God has sent forth the spirit of his son to dwell into your heart. Glory be to King Jesus. You are completely changed into your spirit. But for that to manifest, for that to take over, for that to kill that rust in you, for that to take over your mind, for that to take over your body, and we see you bearing the fruits of worthy of repentance, you have to know. You have to know. And this is why educating yourself on a daily basis is very much key as a Christian. Never think, however, even if you can read this book of this Bible thousands and thousands and thousands and thousands of times, you have to regularly and daily give yourself into understanding. There are two different things. Reading and understanding are very much different. Glory be to King Jesus. Until you get the knowledge, you will never change. Until you start waking up in the morning as you go out and see yourself as the lovely son of Jesus, as the lovely son of God himself, you will never change. And that is where the enemy has caught many of us. He has truly rocked us into the ignorance of what happened into our spirits. To a point, we don't really even know who we are. And the key is there. What has Christ did on the cross? The Bible calls us that we are the new creation. <laughs> the Bible quotes of it that he who knew no sin has become sin that you may be the righteousness of God. Glory be to King Jesus. And this is this should be as a reminder into your spirit. And the moment you continue to see yourself as what Jesus has done into you, as, as what Jesus has truly given into your spirit, your life will change. Glory be to King Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Lord is too gracious. Let me tell you about two things that are always a limit to us to manifest who we are. And when I'm talking about who, we, who you are and who that I am, I'm talking about you seeing yourself as the Lord sees you. Note as who the devil claims that you are. Amen. These are two things that will always be there. What the devil is talking about you and what the Lord Jesus is talking about you. There are two things that you become so. If you encounter and if you see that there is still a saving Jesus that can forgive your sins, 
that can truly change your life into someone that is bearing forth the fruits of repentance, you got the point. Hallelujah. Glory be to King Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. When you return to the book of Ephesians chapter 4 and then verse 24. Ephesians chapter 4 and then verse 24. The Bible is saying, <laughs> and that you put on the new man, which was created according to God, in true righteousness and holiness. The Bible quotes of two kinds of righteousness. The kind of righteousness you produce through your actions, which is the external righteousness, and you should maintain that with your friends with your friends, with your boss, you know, you should do them for good. You should really do good for them, right? But when it comes to God, he does not accept you in accordance to that kind of righteousness. God does not accept us based on our external righteousness. But God has literally gave you and me righteousness and he is righteousness and which is the righteousness by grace and through our faith in him amen and you have to relate to god based not on what you do externally based on what your mind thinks based on what your fresh desires but your relationship to God should really base on who you are in the spirit and based on what he has done for you. And that is why the Bible quotes that true worshipers will only worship God in the spirit and in truth. If you want to take your relationship from one level of glory into another level of glory, I want you to shift your mind from what you are doing physically. Shift your mind from what is taking on into your mind and take it into who Christ made you to be, which is the righteousness of God. Hallelujah. I'm going to talk of two things that will that limit us. My someone is starting. I was laying. What are the two things? Guys, I beg you, I beseech you by the mercies of Christ, hear this out. Hear this out. What are those two things that are limiting us? Because I remember when I was going to pick, when I was going to prepare for what I'm going to be delivering to you guys. Nasendan Lord, what are your people missing? Where are they missing it? What more can you really give to them? The reason why we see the world is getting darker and darker. People are running away from God as if God is a curse, as if being a Christian is a curse. But the utmost reason to meet the problem goes on the church. Because the moment we tear down the limitations, the moment we acknowledge what is limiting us from walking into righteousness, 
What is limiting us from not manifesting a transformed life of Jesus? You find yourself, you do claim yourself to be a believer in the Lord. You do claim yourself to be a Christian in the Lord. But we can't really see it. Let me tell you, there is a saying, it's actually a lie. I don't care about what people think about me. May that never be you. In this kingdom of Christ, you should care what people think about you. Do it positively. That is where the devil is going to lock you into a window of not manifesting the glory of God that you have really received. Glory be to King Jesus. The Bible talks of it, that let your light so shine before men that they may glorify God in heaven. Christianity should not be an inwardly lived life. Christianity should not be a life that you live, you and you. Christianity should not be a life, yeah, it is personal, but the end results should go viral. We should really see, you should really come to a point and say that truly, Cedric has been transformed and he has been changed. And I've told you, first, understand first educate your mind daily on a daily about what is the righteousness of god that i carry in me glory be to king jesus hallelujah hallelujah let me tell you about two limitations i'm about to end guys i'm about to end and we pray the first limitation that the body of Christ has strongholds and mindsets. Strongholds and mindsets. And as I speak in the mighty name of Jesus, may the Lord deliver May the Lord restore a fresh and a new mind in you. Let's get into it. Actually, I wanted to speak about this so heavily. Strongholds and mindsets. Is what is breaking us from seeing God. Is what is stopping you from living out for God. It is what is limiting you. It is a stumbling block. Imitate it is it. A stronghold it is a pattern of thinking. It is the way you think. But based on lies and the lie is not an incorrect statement from me, from anyone. A lie is anything that the Lord has not spoken about you, about me, and about us. That is a lie. So the moment your thinking partner is based on those things that the Lord has not spoke about you, that the Lord has not spoke about your future, that the Lord has not spoke about your present, you got a stronghold. Glory be to King Jesus. And that kind of thinking is always empowered by a demonic spirit. The battle, most of the times, is always into your mind. 
you find yourself that what you are thinking about, what you are telling to yourself is not in line, is not according to what the Lord has spoke about you and about your future. That's a serious stronghold. Glory be to King Jesus. And the bad thing about this thing of having a stronghold, of having a specific certain mindset that runs over and over and over, over and over and over and over, when it is a lie, it makes the word of God of no effect. The first thing that is going to show to you that you have a serious pattern that is not according to the will of God, that is not according to what the Lord is speaking about you, the word of God will have no effect into your mind and into your spirit and into you. My brother and my sister, this is a loud call unto you to enter into what God is speaking about you. Hallelujah. Your viewpoints, your perspectives, your mindset, what is it? What, is, what does it tell you? What does it show you? Because the kind of life that you live, it is always and always according to that. Now here comes something I want to tell you. Your mindset is a door. Your mindset is a channel both to the Holy Spirit and to the demonic power. Glory be to King Jesus. Your mindset, this is very much important that we should really understand what comes into your mind. This is why the Bible, this is why Jesus said that the signs shall follow them that believe. So what we are seeing out of you truly shows us what you are believing in too. Amen. And until your mindset is renewed and focused onto Jesus, you have lost the game. You have lost the point. Glory be to King Jesus. And one of the things that the devil is going to always do, he is always going to keep you there in those four corners of your mind, showing to you how everything in your life is ending, how everything in your life is coming to an end. When the Bible talks of the devil, it calls him the enemy. He does not exist to befriend you. He does not exist to see you prosper, to see you flourish. He exists to destroy and to kill. Amen. Hallelujah. It is very much important to understand of what can the devil do to someone and how can he do it. But one thing about I love about this Lord, the Bible is to be go, Nachindi Christo Yere Kanye, Nachindi Chamu Zanye, or it's a Gukuraho, Emilimo Mibi, Yasatan. The kind of challenge that you have in your life, even tonight, you only need one thing to break through that, which is realigning your mind with the word of God. 
My dear generation, let me tell you, speaking from my personal life that I have really saw, the devil can keep you in bondage. He can keep you into a stronghold. He can make you see shadowly. He can make you see with closed eyes. The Bible talks of it in the book of Second Corinthians chapter 4 and 4 that whose minds the God of this age has blinded who do not believe lest the light of the gospel of the glory of Christ who is the image of God should shine on them. The blindness, spiritual blindness I want you to overcome that. Life is so far. Life is worthy of you receiving Christ, of you realigning your mind. I've told you that what Christ does, he does it into your spirit. He saves your spirit. Then the other law, it is for you to let that kind of thinking, to let that kind of stronghold die. And the only way to kill it, you should kill it by giving yourself into a full knowledge of what Christ has did into you. Amen. But how will that happen when we are so much distracted? The devil is able to keep you very much busy from studying this word. The Bible says that the word that I speak unto you, they are life and they are truth. So when you are opening this book, when you are reading the Bible, when you are educating your mind with the word of God, with the knowledge of God, it is not these written letters. It is life that you are receiving. Glory be to King Jesus. Hallelujah. You need to align your mind. You need to align your mind with what Christ has did. You need to see. You need to behold of who you are and live it outwardly. Hallelujah. Glory be to King Jesus. The only way that Jesus can change your life it is that he renews your identity. And the rest of it is that you continuously educate your mind. Is that you continuously align to what the Lord has done into your spirit. And the way to do that stay in the presence of God, pray, read the Bible, understand. From there, you have to walk and live into that life. The only way to overcome that kind of stronghold that is into your mind, that kind of pattern, that kind of thinking that is into your mind, that is always condemning you, that is always showing you how bad you are and how bad you are to a point Jesus can't accept you and how and, and what you have really did to a point you can't even pray. Let me tell you, the Lord is speaking to your life tonight that he is still a God that can deliver that he is a, still a God that can truly change your mind. Glory be to King Jesus. My end goal of all this is to pull you and drag you into the presence of God. You are not going to be changed unless you learn and master 
the act of staying in the presence of God. Amen. What are you battling with? What are you battling with in your life that the word of God has not talked about? Is it there? Is there anything that could be truly going in, around in your life that, that you are truly completely bothered about that the word of God has not really talked about? Is there anything as that? There is no thing as that. This word of God that you see here has changed my life. I am a testament of what being in the presence of God can do to you. Is it ideas? Is it guidance? Is it the path of life? This very book align your mindset with this word we will see you changed the moment you are too busy for this word the moment you are too busy to even to stay and sit down and seek the Lord My dear brother and my dear sister, don't settle for two cheap things. This word can transform you from good to good. You may be here thinking that, oh, 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 wow, I got it. But there is still more. The journey is far. We still need to push and press. We still need to know. We still need to give our mindsets and our minds. Jesus is ready to change someone's life as he has always been. As he has always been loving. Transformation of your mind by the word of God. Surely we need this. Shobra kudatani bjo na vuze bjos aliko take this home with you. It's a need. It's not a want. When you, when you feel that thing of you not wanting to pray, you not wanting to to dwell in the Bible and in the presence of God, tell yourself, I don't want this. I need this. The kind of spirit of worldliness, of carnality, is going to drag you into a place of death. Unless you receive the love of God. I'm not here to judge you. I'm not here to condemn you. Whatever bad you have did, yes, good and well. But the kind of Jesus that I'm talking about here tonight is the Jesus that can... Tr no, I, I'm not talking only what I've, what I've read, but I'm talking what I saw from my personal life. I'm not here to give my testimony but I've saw what I'm telling you of how much you need this Jesus. Never be filled. 
never be satisfied you continuously need to develop a hunger the moment you are filled and satisfied with what you know about your identity you are gone there is more there is more we need to see a generation we need to see a group of youth whereby anything associated to them is truly projecting Jesus and that can be you that can be me that even in the midst of those people who are hey 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 you are able to stand up and stand on your two legs and boldly live out for Jesus live out that he can truly be seen in your life life is all about dirt don't let the enemy deceive you not mumanza kubesha he is an enemy and ibya gushukisha it's very very simple things but this jesus i'm t- i'm talking about he is the one that promised in the bible that the peace that i live with you i do not give as the world gives something called an inner peace i hear my spirit i hear into my spirit the lord restoring peace in this house I I I I feel it so much. I feel it so much. Let me talk about peace. Amahoro yo mumutima. There are two kinds of peace. According to what God Jesus has said. There is the peace of the world and there is peace of Jesus that he gives. And the problem is most of us is that even when we go outside thinking uh, it is peace it is peace i know it is peace but there is the kind of inner peace that is not associated to how your life is going that is not it does not have anything to do with your falls and highs and everything you need that peace and receive it and receive it bila goye chane kuwa muho kuri isi muri iki gihe in such a generation in such a world that is taking us very much on a very good speed utafite mungere utafite shepherd who tells you who brings into a corner that hey 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 come here Cedric this and this this and this this and this this and this but you won't perceive that unless you see yourself that you really need this that you really need to relate to God on what he has really done the first question is that can Jesus really change your life he can and he is going to even now Maybe you need a financial breakthrough. Maybe you need a direction in life. But there is God that can do wonders. This God that I'm talking about, I have seen him, guys. When you see all this, it's a testament 
of his faithfulness. Me being here and standing in front of you. It's a testament. The only thing that can show that your life is transformed is when you continuously hunger. Is when you continuously need more from the Lord. The moment you are filled up, let me emphasize on this. You no longer want to align your mind with what God has did. You are off track already. And I pity you. And there is no such a good time as this even to give your life to Jesus. That he can really change it. This king of glory that we are talking about is faithful. And according to this word, to the Bible, the Bible says in Hebrews 10 that he who promised is faithful. Not not talking of the promises of the houses that you are going to build good and well but there is something ahead of us and waiting for us to enter into that amen if you want to give your life to Jesus and truly repent. I'm not. I'm, to, I'm not talking about of uh, mere words. The grace of God is always available for people who have come to the end of themselves. If you want to come to the end of yourself and truly make a decision and change. Jesus is real. I always tell people because sometimes we, we, we be good at coming at conferences, going to churches and we tend to normalize things to a point where, hey, yes, wow, good and well, good and well, good and well, good and well. To a point even we no longer feel that he is real and that whatever he promised if it is his coming back, if it is his rapture, rapture. indeed he is faithful to fill dirt. And the Bible says that they just shall live by faith. He talked of it in John 14. Gahonja. You old. This is a need for you, for your life. I need to pray for you. I need to pray for you. I need to pray for you. If you are here and you know that in your heart there is conviction that is not you, that is not your mind, that is the Holy Spirit. With our eyes bowed down, Ask 
Ask yourself, ask yourself, ask yourself, talk to yourself. If you know you have not yet already received Jesus, there is no such time to receive him as this. The promise The promise by Tamboka Bakadufasha mukuramya Talk to yourself. I will check your heart. Check your heart. Nibuze kutara ho buzima bwa Kristo. This is a very wonderful moment. Wonderful moment. Wonderful moment. To give your life to Christ. I don't want you to do this as in while you are ashamed. I've told you, you are not here for anyone. You are here for Jesus. Boldly. Don't see this. Boldly. Get up on your knees and make those steps coming to the Lord. Do it boldly. Boldly and boldly. If you know you have not yet given your life to Jesus Christ, boldly come out of there. Let nothing distract you. Let nothing tell you. Let not pride over mediocrity. Even, even stop, stop you from, from receiving, receiving this game. He wants to change your life. He wants to transform your life. He's the God of love. And he wants to love you. He wants you to, to, to come closer even to him. and weary this God can tap into your spirit and changes it and gives you a new name and a new identity in him as we sing this song if you are here and you hear a deep conviction in your mind Just come over, come over here, and we help you receive him.
the blood of Jesus is still available even today to cleanse and wash you and wash your sins and purify your heart
Amarasso, the the Lord for his holy blood that is even able to cleanse. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 This is that precious moment of you. If you know you have not yet given your life to Jesus. Boldly. Ushizamanga. Nasoni Nachimnaro. Mite. Jesus is here. He wants, as we have sought, to change your life. Let nothing stop you. Let nothing limit you from receiving this King of Kings. to thank the Lord for even as we are youth Tunga na gurcha Tukwa rahayu wazima uga chukilistu We lift his glory But we are going to pray Now, if you know that for a time you have given your life to Christ, but you have not yet experienced that total transformation and by His Spirit, this is your turn as well. This is your turn as well. Oba yuziko. Haro wasubi nyuma wenda. Mubjukora. 
like the first love you used to have for the Lord Jesus is not there anymore this is your chance as well if you know you need that energy that strength from the Lord If you know that you need the fire of the Lord to burn into your life and break those strongholds, this is your chance. This is your turn. Even tonight, even tonight, you can appraise for Christ. This is that generation, this is that generation. Yes, this is that generation. This is that generation that ought to live for Him, that ought to ought to live that He may be seen. Oh, Sharado what we do is not by power.
You want to burn for Christ. You want that Jesus be seen in you. There is only one thing that makes that happen. The prophet talked of it that it is not by power, it is not by mighty, but it is by the Spirit of the Lord. This is that generation. These are those youth that the Bible talks about. When you hear of people as Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, what comes into your mind? These people who stood on their purity by fire, by force. Whether the Lord says them or not, what comes into your mind when you hear people like Daniel who purposed in his heart not to defy himself? What comes into your mind when you hear people like Joseph? One of the long things about character and the thing the Lord is breaking it. The Lord is breaking it. The mentality of years, the mentality of I will do this when I'm 30. I will do this when I'm 40. I will do this when, 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 when. The time is now to live for Christ. To live that he may be seen. To live that as people come, they see, as they steal, we are set on fire and for life. Don't let any sin of him. Don't, don't let any thing of him come into your heart and take the praise of God. Raise up your hand, your right hand, and let your left hand touch your chest. You are going to make a confession before the Lord. Ask him for his spirit and his genuine power to walk alive in you. And then we'll pray. <laughs> and then you'll tell me. Pray with me. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. <laughs> say it louder. Say it louder. Father, in the name of Jesus. I come before you with an empty heart. That you may feel me. That you may feel your spirit in me. That your spirit may be alive in me. That your spirit may govern my mind. That your spirit may govern my actions. Father, I receive the power of the Holy Spirit in my life. And as I live, it is manifesting. It is daily manifesting. Desire, desire, desire. 
Hunger, hunger. This is a war. And this is a war.
the first of the Lord. Hallelujah. Let it be your portion. Let it be your treasure. Let it be the one thing that comes before anything else in your life. Our God is not a liar. He promised that those who hunger and thirsty for righteousness shall be filled. That is not a lie. If you are something you will do, you will be filled. You will be filled. Hunger. Thirsty. Wish to see more. Wish to draw near even more. Let nothing make you forget. And lastly, we are going to pray. Hold someone in your hand. Hold someone in your hand. Make sure you hold someone in your hand. This is a prayer for our dear nation. This is a prayer for our fellow youth who are blinded who have not yet come into the knowledge of Christ, he can do it as he did it even time before. Mm. Oh my God, thank you. I feel restoration. I feel the peace of God coming into someone's life. Oh my God. Can't wait to see you after here. And there is power even in Yes, he's here, he's here. He's here, he's here. Focus on him, don't look at me, focus on him. You need more. Declare it, declare it like you mean it. That is you and me. That is you and me. Chain, to break every chain, to break every chain, to break every chain, 
to break every chain, to break every chain, to break every chain. Oh, raise your voice tonight. Let the power of God fill your life. Fill your life in the name of Jesus. What your eye have never saw. What you have never dreamt. generation I the chains that the Lord told to watch and pray I see the for they do not know the time I see the chains oh, oh, oh. the power of God in your life no don't take this for granted this is for the people with faith remember this is for the people who know what they are talking about this is for the people. And I pray that in the name of Jesus. As you hold hands together, make sure you are holding someone. As we connect into this unity, as the youth of this lovely nation, Rwanda, the flag of Christ is being risen. That people are no more in bondage, that people are no more in ignorance, that people are not blinded father lady 
Father, let it let it rain, let it rain. Let it rain, let it rain. Let it rain. attention to that pay attention to that believe God for the new move in your life he can use you to change this dying world be bold enough be bold enough be bold enough to tap into that to see that you and me can do something that you and me oh my god yours is the king yours is the glory this is what you came here for do it intentionally i see people distract don't be distracted my friend don't be distracted
this world. Is it peace? Is it peace? In your family? In your Victims of foolishly small things that the devil is bringing to us. Raise your eyes above that. So higher in the spirit. Financial breakthrough. Finances being restored unto the glory of God. May whatever you touch be blessed in the name of Jesus. May whatever you touch, either if it is a business, either if it is a job, let it prosper in the mighty name of Jesus. Not in your name, not in my name, but in the restoring Jesus. Families reuniting. I cast away the spirit of anger in the name of Jesus. Walk in purity, prevail in righteousness. Amen. And amen. And amen. You may be seated in the name of Jesus. Lastly, lastly, I want to thank people. You may see this and wonder where is this coming from what is this what's going on what's prayer party what's the promise we are a product of god's grace we are a product of boldness to step into the comfort zone and try out our faith. And the Lord did. If you are here and you know that the Lord showed you something, if you are here and by any means you know, you truly know, is an acquisition and how we should be canyon. Quality man, you could be do so. Faithfully do so. Your eyes will be amazed. I know what I'm telling you. Let nothing stop you. Let not financial stop you. Step out. Step out. Start where you are. I remember myself. I was crying to the Lord. And telling him. Lord, I need to serve you. But I don't, I, I don't even see a glimpse. I don't even see a kadomo of where to start to serve you. You can imagine what the Lord spoke to me. He said, Cedric, you have everything you need to serve me. And I said, Lord, you mean what? What are you trying to mean? He opened my eyes to the cell phone that I had by then, a telephone, which you also have, as I do have. He said, Cedric, this will work out. This is a channel. A telephone, no any other thing, a telephone. 
unlock. We are celebrating our second year. We are celebrating our second year this coming August. We have so God. Munyemerere Chimiman. Lord, my heart is full. I have truly saw you. That you can even work wonders and miracles. God is faithful. I have saw it. Believe in him. Little by little, you will get there. We are still moving. Don't let the devil distract you and take away and take you away from what the Lord has called you to do. Hold on it. Hold on it. Allow me to appreciate my committee wherever they are, guys. <laughs> wherever they are. They may get on their knees. They may get on, sorry, they may get on their feet. Allow me to thank these people. Allow me to thank these people. Allow me to thank these people. These people have believed in me and have believed in what even the Lord has, has put in me at a zero level, at a zero stage. I told them, come, let's do this. This and this should do this, this and this, this and this, this and this. And no one even could quarrel and say, hey, what I get out of that. Thank you so much for being faithful. And may the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord honor you. Nawatari Hano, who are online. God bless you, Willa. God bless you, Theam. You have truly. These people of our hands, Ariko, when you see their activeness, you wonder what, what's going on. May the Lord bless you even more. May the Lord bless you genuinely from my heart to your life. May the Lord bless you. Thank you so much. You may sit. And I as well thank people. Who knew me even before you guys? I thank my father in the house. You may. This man came into my life at the very perfect time that I needed someone to help me. Genuinely, he has held my hand. The Lord has used him to strengthen me. In times of discouragement, I run to him and he truly renews my strength. I thank you so much, sir. May the Lord bless you. Amen. I joined the prayer party altar family and the entire house to thank you for what you have did, for your commitment to this ministry, and what you are continuously doing. May the Lord bless you. I love you so much, sir. God bless you. I'm still thanking people. Allow me to thank my dear auntie here. Please, you can, you can move to us. <laughs> Allow me to thank her also. You know, for you guys to see this, Suko, our highs and lows are not there. Nuko, we have people in our lives who are like, Cedric, you can do this. People 
more can come, you know. So thank you so much, my dear auntie. You know how much you have been so supportive to this ministry of the recent days of New York. Very much supportive. Very much supportive. Thank you so much for acknowledging the call in my life and even helping me out. Thank you. God bless you. I as well want to acknowledge <laughs> I as well want to acknowledge these four brothers here. Thank you so much for what the Lord is using you to do. And may the Lord strengthen you. And may the Lord bring you even up higher and higher and higher. Thank you for allowing our invitation. Even every man of God, any woman of God, that the Lord has pressed a ministry fellowship into his life and part of his calling, I acknowledge you and thank you so much for allowing our invite. God bless you. My God, my God. Look at the, let's give it up for this team. Allow me to welcome my brother Brace. Allow me to thank this man, Chani. Chani, Chani, Chani. I remember when it came into my mind, when it came to my spirit that we should host a conference called specifically for an encounter for worship, word, and prayer, Henri. I went to him. I really believe the calling in his life that is to bless this generation. And the entire team as well, they promise worship. Not longer from here. You will know more, you know? So thank you so much for allowing the call of God and even for supporting this ministry ever since and believing in what the Lord has truly given us to do. May the Lord bless you and may the Lord strengthen you. And even may this be a new door, a new opportunity, a new level for you and your ministry. May the Lord praise you and the entire team. I love you so much. Thank you so much. I want to thank prayer party altar members. The soul is a Ariko, you people are amazing. How comes you believe into audios, into even really online? How comes? How comes? Thank you so much for even coming to this ministry, being members of it, following online, every Tuesday, every Saturday we pray. Thank you so much for reserving your time even to be here. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. Lastly, 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 I want to thank the organizers of this conference. Papa Sam, help me give it up for that man. He's our leader of project organization department. And truly, since Emmanuel Gomujisha for leading us even into organizing this. 
Iman Gomujis. And the entire team from the financial department. Thank you so much, my dear Lindy. Thank you. These people have support. When you see these guys, you need to be them a frank girl, my Yaruguan. Now, 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 this and this. And lastly, I want to say to you three words. I love you guys. May the Lord bless you. Give it up for Cedric. Give it up for Cedric. Give it up for Cedric. Hallelujah. Na vuzi ngo nuvanga oko waj ni cha kuri owe. Kote kwa tanje tufuka. Uta ashiko wajang. Chabari cha. Mwenye melele. Who recognize the man of God. The lead pastor of glory to glory. International Ministries. Give it up for Pastor Eli, the man of God himself. Yes. Yeah, we give you the regards to your wife as prayer party. We honor you, man of God. One of the ministers today who are pure, Pastor Eli is among them. And these days, these days, they are few. They are few. So I can recommend him. Hallelujah. So let me give you some announcements, then we, we worship. Hallelujah. Cedric said something.
So it's not something that I always feel maybe feeling agache. Arikio kabai, I want to release something. Would you allow me release something on your life? Mwebge mwabi feelings. Koko ni mwebge nyine. Na hama gari uyu mosi. Mwabi nye mere? Kinga umosi. Brother, are you in ministry? You are? What do you do? Worshipper. Mm. The Lord has a great purpose on your life. And... He's going to use you mightily, mightily. And yeah, he's going to use you. He's going to use you. Father, I release it now on his life. Receive it by the power of the Holy Ghost. Now in the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Jesus, mighty name. Receive it by the power of the Holy Ghost.
God, please keep the heart of worship and as you praise, as you worship God, God is going to open doors that no man can think of. generation may the lord bless you increase you abacuranzi bacu rero namwe mbagereho ndabizi ntabwo bakunze kubibuka yewe ndabibuka i'm a music person so i love music may the lord bless you increase you do great and mighty things for you there is one thing that i've learned in ministry and this is humbleness this is serving the lord and as you serve the Lord, please, in your humbleness and in your meekness, the Lord will increase you. He will take you further. Don't worry. Just use your talent. The Bible says that David used to play harp and demons could leave people. My prayer for you is that as you <laughs> touch, that demons will leave people that sickness will lose many and
and that hearts will be mended again by the power of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. It is my prayer. It is my prayer. And the Lord bless you. We love you. Shalom. Oh, 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 oh. Our brother. Yes, you had something to say? Yes. Now is your time. Good evening, everyone. Nagondo monokonda kuvuga chani. Chereke ringomga. Gambere nda vanza goshi mira wilson. Uyu muga umwana hano niyo vanza nyaha. Uburijot kwa huye. Nibinu na 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 wano burijambi sawa anora. Tukawu ya kubera yuko ama debater nibijamora ndana bijijisha. So I took invitation to his school. Aho higa. Then nda haguma. Numva harichinu chinsu ni chila kuhaguma. Uwende ahanose na jaga njanya ma invitation nibindi naraza ganga ita nga nijende. Baka za za cha anga waka bireka Bja waka raka zika But when I reached in his school Nuvisha yuko Mindutse Nuvisha yuko Harichi nuchi mgira ngu Ivaha Don't go yet Naraha guminye Ngomeza kufuga na nabo I helped them Uburijwa na rinsho wa yabugo wase Nibugo wuga ambere Neme kwa ambara uniform Yichi ndi chigo for free. Then mavu ye ishguidi na mgira ngo pray to God uyisabe abari iza kuhishura. Then he gave me this man as a friend. Kujira ngo njenjo ini nge mazemuri prayer party njira ngi minsi necha angita anu. I saw it on his status. I only saw the t-shirts. I didn't see anything else. I want to join this family. I came out delivered now we were delivered nje 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 kugubu urijo ugagufasha 
ushaka go connecting kuri anointing so as prayer party tukajira facebook prayer party altar fellowship tukajira tiktok at prayer party altar bifatany tukajira youtube channel prayer party altar fellowship so ushaka kujira ibindi wa wabaza tujira email nayo ni prayer party altar at gmail.com biroroshi watwandikira twagusubiza ah then nimero sinzi ni amwe kuyandika ni 078 gatandatu kabiri kane kabiri rimwe karindwi icena ndasubiramo 0 karindwi umunani gatandatu kabiri kane kabiri rimwe karindwi icyenda ushaka kutwandikira kuri whatsapp reka naye nkubwirie wakwandikaho 0 karindwi umunani 0 kane kane rimwe kane kabiri karindwi ndasubiramo 0 karindwi umunani 0 kane kane rimwe kane kabiri karindwe ushaka kujiterana natwe online ngo twabwiye ko tena online ni kwa kabiri no kwa gatandatu sambini nigice ndakura ritse nuzigera ubura rwose nuzigera ubura tugira bible studies cyangwa bible classes zijya ziba ushaka ku registeringa uja kuri IG ya prayer party outa muri bio hari mo link you can register then the promise aho abasanga instagram yabo ni the promise slash worship slash rwanda youtube channel the promise worship rwanda nimo kubivuga rwose ufite internet wawe rimo gusubscribe inga cha following ya wa bikora rwose then nimero yabo 078 Ichenda, zero gatanu ichenda, gatanu gatanu rimwe ndasubiramo 0 karindwi umunani ichenda, zero mirongo itanu nicenda gatanu gatanu rimwe rero reka ewa je ukubita umukunga dushima imana turamya ibyo imana yakoze mwakoze kuza Niba kitagufata yanga ha kiragufata usoka I'm telling you I'm telling you I'm telling you Unaryamye cyagufata There is no there is no na, na limitation hari Let's welcome the promise Dinete zabonetse ndazifite Amen Amen Toshakushima ubuyobozi bwa church bwa duhaye hano a uh, turabishimye tubikwe ku mutima abahari bakiri hano bi church imana ibaho umugisha cyane ukoze umuri mukomeye cyane kuri the promise na prayer party imana ibaho umugisha cyane um, hama ikindi muvandi mwacu twamwakirie ah ah Nundi mono esha ku joining at the promise yumva ashaka gukorera imana binyuze muri music nako dukora music gusa any talent ushaka yuko wa ikoresha uko uramye imana you can come you can come tugafatanya urugendo tukuba ku bwami bw'imana hano kwise amen amen hari ya hari inyuma hari urupapuro cyangwa mushobora kwandika nimero kugira ngo umuntu wese ushaka gukora umurimo w'Imana ubumva twagendana muri urugendo atwandikire tumushyire muri the promise amen ah zero karin tubwireme zero karin 1809 reka isubiramo umuntu wese ushaka yuko zero karin 1809 
tugafata contact za tukazabavugisha amen hama tujye kusoza tubyina twishima imana yuko yabanye natwe help me thank this man of god let's give it up for him thank you so much yohi <laughs> You are just amazing. He has a nation of faith people. Reach out to YouTube. Go and watch um, Faith Nation podcast by Yuhi Chirenga Albert. Thank you so much. Yes. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, now on the feet, on the feet, Now on the feet, on the feet, on the feet, you are a good gamo, and another, another, another,
Amen. 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 Sawa, sawa, sawa. Na go move. Shema gachi. Hallelujah. Aku, aku, aku. Sawa, sawa, sawa. 